We have never experienced anything like that. It was the scariest thing. We are following up on a dangerous situation on the Turnpike in Erie County Sunday afternoon. This dash cam video you're looking at here, we obtained shows slush from a turnpike plow soaring over the median and onto people's cars. It all happened on the turnpike near Sandusky around 1:45 in the afternoon. Investigators say at least 40 vehicles were damaged by the snow. You see some of that even right here as well. And 12 people also were injured. As News 5's Clay Lepard explains, drivers could not believe what was happening and the damage done. All of a sudden, from a distance, we saw this, you know, rainbow of snow. I'm like, whoa, what the heck is this? Cascading snow 20 feet into the air. I clutched the steering wheel, I was white knuckling it. If it wasn't on video, you might not believe it. The moment a stream of slush from a plow truck crossed the Ohio Turnpike and landed on dozens of cars and semis. When it hit us, Everyone slams on the brake. You could not see out of the win any windows. Everything was covered. Jerry Green captured this video showing the trail of cars parked on the side of the road in the aftermath. Everybody's crashing and swerving out the way. And you see people's window, window shows caved in. And you're like, what in the world is going on? Like His truck was fine. Others, not so much. I didn't realize there was any damage to my vehicle until I went to change lanes afterwards. and. I started getting error messages from my, my tractor saying that I had turn signal faults and low beam faults and headlight faults. As soon as it happens, we all thought that we got to a car accident because that's how bad the force was. Those videos don't even show the intensity of what we went through. In total, investigators say the plow truck dished out enough slush to injure 12 people and damage 40 vehicles from broken mirrors to shattered windshields, wrecked axles, and dinged up doors. This is the dent that is preventing me from opening my driver's side door any more than this. So, not great. Now drivers are turning to the Ohio Turnpike, looking for answers as to how they're supposed to repair their cars. I want them to know it was completely irresponsible. We're paying to be on that road. <laughs> <laughs> and to have that happen. And why this happened in the first place. You know, just idiotic. I don't know, like, you know, it's crazy though. Like, what do you, what do you, what do you think was going through your mind that you think, 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 think that's okay to do? Dumbfounded that somebody could be so reckless. A spokesperson with the Ohio Turnpike confirmed the employee driving that plow truck was placed on administrative leave and was sent for mandatory drug and alcohol testing. In Erie County, Clay Lepard, News 5. Video so wild. Wow. So what's next for drivers involved in all of this? In a statement to News 5, the Ohio Turnpike and Infrastructure Commission spokesperson saying in part, quote, we are coordinating our efforts with the Ohio State Highway Patrol and are currently contacting each affected customer directly. So far, though, several drivers we have spoken with say they have not heard a thing from the Turnpike Commission.